Hey guys, what's popping? Um, I'm doing a little story time because I mean I'm bored and I have nothing else to do because we had no school today. So, <laughs> um, I'm going to insert like a picture sort of thing. Um, I edit with iMovie on my phone because I left my camera at my mom's. Oopsies, because I was gonna do it either, but Dana came over and it did not work. <laughs> Um, it's gonna be a really cool video though. So I'm recording on my phone. But like, here we go. I'm gonna love you forever. Yeah, that's Possum, my very cute love. She's so freaking loving. Like, um, the story about Possum is. I was snowboarding with Dana, and my mom calls me, and she said, we have a new cat that we need to save, and I'm watching Kitten Lady right now. She is my idol. I love Kitten Lady, like, Kitten Lady. Kitten Lady, sorry about that, my phone just crashed. Um, yeah, like Kitten Lady is my idol. I'm watching her right now. Um, I love Kitten Lady so much. Um, she does inspire me, but I love cats so much. I want to save them, and there needs to be way more people like us. Like, I mean, there is a lot of people now that like help cats, except like. But like, there needs to be everyone. Everyone needs to do this. Like, they need to care about cats. When I'm older, I want to work at a vet. I want to get a college degree for veterinarian, and then I want to work at a veterinarian for like one to three years, and then I want to foster cats. Like, I want to fly all over the place and foster cats, and save cats, save kittens, save cats. It does need to be saved. And then, like, when I'm older, I also want to foster dogs. Um, what's the point? Those dogs also need help, and I love dogs, too. But, like, I love cats more. Sorry. Um, but, like, I love Kitten Lady so much. She inspires me so much. Um, yeah. But going back to my story time. Um, Possum, aka Frosty. I'm just going to call her Possum. She's a girl. And my mom calls me and says, we have a new cat. And like I said, I was snowboarding. When I come home, um, she tells me this story um, of how we got our new cat, Possum. Um, she's so cute. She looks like Charlie, my other cat. Yeah. Um, she was my mom's friend, Amanda, found her on the side of the room. And she was laying there and she was all hurt and stuff. And she was basically skin and bones, I think. Yeah. Um, she picked her up and brought her to my mom's house. And the thing is, her tail was frostbit at the tip. Um, and when my mom said when she brought her in the house, um, it sounded like someone was trying to cut off her tail or something. That's how painful it was for the kitty, for Possum. It made me cry so much. And also that day when I got there, Sammy ran away. <laughs> I was crying so much. But I mean, she's back. She was in heat. It was weird. She might be pregnant. I kind of hope she's pregnant. Those would be super cute kitty cats. Like, she was in heat, but yeah, whatever. Um. Yeah, so it's just kind of a stressful night for me because we got a new cat and we need to save that cat. And we see me also ran away and I was outside for like an hour trying to find her. But okay, moving on with my story. Um, and so she brought her back outside with our barn animals that are basically stole from the neighbors. Um, we feed them every day. They're fat. Um, they used to be really skinny. I love them so much. Mwah. Um, and so, my mom 
there to meet Possum for the very first time in my lifetime meeting the best cat ever. Um, she's very sweet. When she was out there, I put her like 50 times. She's so pretty. She's so cute. Um, she's the best cat we've ever saved. Um, so her tail was frostbit, two inches of it. And she also had a disease in her tail. And she was just in so much pain. But when she got outside, she wasn't in that much of pain because the cold was like containing it, not hurting. So then the vet was not open during Saturday or Sunday. Um, my mom found her Saturday night. Well, my mom's friend brought her yet. Um, and Monday, a couple of days ago, my mom brought her in. Um, she had surgery the next day. Um, I will always remember this date. 11, sl no, not 11. <laughs> 2 slash 6 slash 18. I will always remember the date when she got her surgery. Um, so she got 2 inches cut off and here's the photo. Yeah. <laughs> um, that's possum. Possum is awesome. Um, so she woke up Wednesday afternoon, and the vet closed early that day. So we, my mom is at work and stuff. So we had to wait the next day to pick her up, and she got all the medicine she needed and stuff to get recovered, basically. Um. And we're so lucky to have other people in this world to help out with paying for cats in need. So I don't remember what, but it's like cat thing donation. We got all the money to save the cat. Um, she's the best cat ever. <laughs> like, I've only met her once because I had to go to my dad's the next day, but. Next week is going to be blowing up with videos of her. Possum and Sammy. Sammy loves her, but Possum's still like a little scared. Charlie likes her. Okay, Charlie's the cat that we found on the side of the road. About to get ran over, but we saved him. Why his name is Charlie is because we didn't know if his boy girl. Okay. Um, I should just do full story time soon. I'm just on my cat. Comment down below if I should do that. Um, and yeah, Possum is awesome. I'm gonna put like an outro thing, a video of her, and you guys get to see a little bit more of her. Yeah, I hope you guys love this, and don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below. Um, oh, and I have a challenge for you guys. If you spam the comments, and whoever spams it the most will get a shout out next week's video. Okay, and whoever did not make it to the end of the video like this, comment down below. Um, oh my god, there was a ghost in the background. I don't know. Um, don't forget to spam in the comments, and yeah, that's my story time of possum. See ya!